Serial screening, I think, has been underappreciated. Um, people often think, well, you, you do screening and you repeat it again, but it's much more than that. Uh, if you just perform regular screening, what happens is that it's sort of a hit and miss. If a person has an early unknown skin cancer, you find it, great. But what if the person walks in the door with an advanced disease? You'll find it, but the likelihood is the patient may not survive. With serial screening, once we have established the person has no cancer to begin with, and they come back six months or close to six months, and they do develop a melanoma, or any other type of skin cancer for that matter, we almost certainly will detect it in its early stages. In the, in the first 17 years of the program, we had no nodular melanomas. And, the, and nodular melanoma is said to make up, based on the different series, about 15 to 30 percent of all melanomas. It's been taught for 40 years uh, that these are lesions that suddenly just show up in advanced stages and uh, many of these people do not survive. We found none of these. What's going on? We believe we are actually picking up precursors of nodular melanoma. That's what seemed to be the best explanation before they get to that stage. And we have in fact seen uh, some uh, uh, melanomas, amelanotic, no obvious pigmentation, small little red bumps that in fact, look very much like what has been described in early nodular melanoma. And in fact, these kinds of melanomas in recent years have been more frequent than the more traditional melanomas with ABCDE features. We have learned that it's been very valuable to recommend to patients who come in who have had obvious risk factors for melanoma. This would be people who have had a lot of sun exposure, perhaps a family history of melanoma. Um, and many, many patients go to dermatologists for treatment of their actinic keratoses. And I think those patients uh, who have had that much sun to get multiple actinic keratoses and other risk factors, uh, the dermatologists should recommend that those individuals uh, be screened uh, on a serial basis.